So basically it was about this time last year, we were in California, my wife Caitlin and Luke and Haley were on vacation and um, we knew that Luke was gonna propose at the end of it. Haley didn't know because it was gonna be a surprise. So throughout the whole vacation, Luke was being crazy, like I can't wait till this day, I can't wait till that day. And then finally his pressure built up by the end of the week. The day before he was gonna do it, he was like, ah oh, man, guys, tomorrow's gonna be so fun, I can't wait. We're like, yeah, we know, it's vacation, every day's fun, right? Um, but Luke's like, are you guys excited for tomorrow? I'm excited for tomorrow. Are you guys excited? When I was growing up, every night, I would pray for a man who was smart, driven, and loved God. You were exactly that person, Luke. The more I'm with you, the more I see you grow, and I fall a little more in love with you every day. I can't imagine my life without you. You're the perfect amount of balance I need in my life. You push me when I need to be pushed and calm me down when I need to be calmed. I love you so much and I can't wait to marry you. Finally the day comes. Um, we're supposed to go to dinner and uh, we go, we get all dressed up, we're gonna go to a nice dinner. Luke's all excited again, but we stopped at um, this place called the Urban Lights. Um, in LA, it's like this really romantic place with all these lamps outside, so really cool and pretty, and they were taking pictures. Um, and Caitlin uh, was, you know, taking pictures, and then finally Luke drops down, asks her the question, she says yes, obviously here we are. And at the end of it, we're like, you know, we're so excited, this was like the pinnacle of our trip, we're like, congrats, it was so fun. And then at the end, we're like, Haley, did you know it was coming? Like, did you have any idea? And she's like, yeah, honestly, Luke is so obvious. She's like, on the way here, I almost texted my sister letting her know I'm about to get proposed to. <laughs> I remember meeting you for the first time freshman year and thinking how gorgeous you are. I'm so grateful that God brought our past together and I get to be a part of your life. I pray that I will be the godly man that I was made to be. I pray that I will honor God with our marriage. I love you so much and I'm so excited for the next chapter of life together. They say love like this comes once in a lifetime. Dearly beloved, we've come together today in the presence of God to join this man and this woman in holy matrimony. There are no obligations on earth sweeter or more tender than you're about to make. There are no vows more solemn than you're about to speak. There's no human institution more sacred than marriage. It's the holiest of all earthly relationships based on a deep, inseparable union of two souls. You are Happy Haley found her other half in you. Um, I'm so excited and looking forward to seeing y'all's relationship grow over the years. I love you both so much. Um, cheers to the happy couple. You guys got a you know relationship based on love, respect, and friendship, um, and they're a team at the end of the day. So that's why they work. So we're so excited for you guys. Um, happy that you're joining the family, Haley. I feel like your family are ready, but nice to make it legal, right? <laughs> But yeah, we love you guys so much, so cheers to the happy couple.
Isaac and Haley, as you've joined together today in matrimony, having vowed your love for each other and have exchanged rings as a token of those vows, I am honored and privileged to pronounce you husband and wife and what God has joined together. Let no one separate. You may kiss your ride. Hey. <laughs> hey. Blue sky.